Most people in America are familiar with how we put people in place in jobs. There's a standardized job employment application process. We either see a sign on a building in our community that is in an interest area that we're willing to consider working in based on where we are in our finances and in our life and based on what we know in general about what people get paid in certain industries. It is very possible that I am relatively old about what a different city that I'm accused to, accustomed to living in might pay an employee. But at the same time, I recognize there is cost of living differences that might make the general practice basically the same. In other words, that certain retail companies pay in a certain area of, of pay wage, but because cost of living is increased, that that increase in wage may not be the same. Am I making sense today? I cannot say. I have not had a lot to eat today, and that is truthful, but because of the fact that I am working fiercely on rebuilding my life after a lot of betrayals, a lot of lies placed on my life, and a lot of rights abuses. And I emphasize that a lot. I do get played with by people who want to come up regularly to give me food, and what I regularly consider is that these people are rude. They are rude because they are making the presumption that they know what I want to eat, and a lot of times it is mainly their leftovers or things they bought for themselves and they decide, you know, I do have stuff at home, I can just entreat him with this and give him this treat. And the truth is, it's not usually a treat for me. Nine times out of ten, the bags that I'm trying to be gifted are things I'm allergic to. Most of my own family of origin, those that are still present and living, do not know most of my allergies because we just didn't have that kind of a relationship of dining together beyond the events that my mother and father planned and negotiated with the culinary folks and the foodies of my family. Most of us are actually foodies. We know what is good food, we know what is quality food, we know its general properties, we know what it generally does for us because we have listened at nauseam to my late mother talk about it. And practically I am very upset by the fact that my elder siblings did not help to produce a book of mom's uh, home remedies because she is incredible with that. Life in America is different today. Life in America will remain different going forward because of the number of foreigners that have come into America without our lawful consent. We have those people entering into the workforce. We have those people affecting our children. We have those people affecting and influencing what our pop culture is and we have to pay attention to those things again. In life, people will presume that someone is a racist or elitist if they don't want to interact with them, but the reality of my life and the abilities of my life and the assessments that I have done all through my life in business makes me have to decide where my time needs to be invested. What I have known, of course, from my mother's and father's tutelage and parentage is that you want to participate in groups that are taking you in the direction of your dreams as opposed to participating with people that want to thwart and interfere and impede those dreams.